Let us jump back to the year 1917. Einstein had just finished general relativity, a theory so powerful it reshaped our understanding of gravity. Naturally, he tried applying it to the entire universe. But there was a problem. His equations didn't describe a quiet, static cosmos. They described a universe that had to be either expanding or contracting. That completely clashed with the scientific belief at the time that the universe was eternal and unchanging. So Einstein added something new, the cosmological constant represented by the Greek letter lambda. It acted like a background gravitational pressure built into space itself. By carefully tuning it, he forced the universe to stay still. But he didn't get to enjoy that fix for long. Just over a decade later, Edwin Hubble discovered that the universe is expanding. No static cosmos. No need for lambda. Einstein eventually called the constant his greatest blunder. Fast forward to 1998. Two research teams were trying to figure out how much matter exists in the universe. By measuring how quickly cosmic expansion was slowing down, they hoped to settle the debate. Except, expansion wasn't slowing down at all. It was speeding up. This was a shock. There wasn't nearly enough matter to cause that acceleration. The simplest explanation. Bring back Lambda, now rebranded as dark energy, a built-in repulsive force woven into space-time. Before this discovery, cosmologists had built a clean, elegant, standard model of the universe. But accelerated expansion shattered it. In its place came a new framework. LCDM cosmology. Lambda for dark energy. CDM for cold, dark matter. LCDM is stunningly successful. With just a handful of parameters, it explains the expansion of the universe, the cosmic microwave background, the large-scale structure of galaxies, baryon acoustic oscillations, the entire evolution of the cosmos. And yet, it's probably wrong. We don't know what dark energy is, we don't know why it exists, and we don't know why it started accelerating the universe when it did. What we do know is that dark energy didn't just change a few numbers. It rewrote cosmology and left us with one of the greatest mysteries in all of science.